beautiful day here at Mid Michigan. It's 49 degrees and sunny. The wind is a blowing, so that air is cold, but the sun is nice and warm and toasty. I'm on my way to um, Mount Pleasant. I'm going to go to the Walmart down there and buy me some packing supplies. I am moving to another state to, um, to spend some time with my son and his family for a while. I just went through a divorce. I am 73 years old. Yeah, kind of old to go through a divorce, but sometimes you just got to do what you got to do. It just wasn't working, and I was very unhappy. was a YouTuber here, a beauty channel, unboxing mainly, a little bit of lifestyle, a little bit of vlogging. Meanwhile, I had to uh, unsubscribe to all my boxes because I'm moving. I don't want to start those up until I get established there. And again, I may not because I have way too much makeup. Oh my gosh. When I was packing, or I still am, I couldn't believe it all and I've thrown out a lot and I've also been giving away a lot to my friends and family. Boy, oh boy, this road is, whoop, not the road, <laughs> the wind is really strong, it's just took my car. Okay, <laughs> freaked me out there for a minute. We get some winds up here in the plains, well, it, right here it is. The farm community right here, right here where I'm at. More north where I live is woods, <laughs> forest. But anyway, uh, I digress. <laughs> yeah, I'm gonna go live near my son and his family. I have grandchildren and great grandchildren down there. I've yet to spend any real long term time with. I want to get to know them better. I've seen them, of course, through the years, but just briefly, you know, visiting here and there. And I want to get reacquainted with them. I haven't even met two of my great-grandchildren. I have three, and I've only met one. He was a year old, and then she had two more since, and that's been three years ago. So she, she has some stair-step babies there, so I'm excited to go see them. Two boys and a girl. So I'm really excited to meet them. Chickens have a 
chickens right now. I can have chickens down there, but I only have four if I move into the city. We can have eight in the city where I am now, but down there you only have four. This is a bigger city. I guess that's why. I don't know why. Probably because it's you're really close. You're really close to each other. Um, but I'm not taking them. I when we sell the house, we have to sell the house yet and split the proceeds. Hopefully that will happen in the spring, and then I'll come up here and liquidate. Well, I could leave the rest of the stuff I haven't, I didn't take that I don't want. I have a big, huge moving sale. And perhaps take four of the chickens in. That's my plan. Whether or not that'll happen, I don't know. But he's going to maintain the house, live in the house until it's sold. So might as well, I don't want it really empty anyway. We'll be moving, driving in December down there, first of the first of September. Hopefully, it's snow holds out. Um, it, it'll be okay. We we usually don't get snow, but sometimes I've been known. It's been known to snow hard that, that early. Shoot, it can snow right now, easily enough. And it's about a oh, seven-hour trip, maybe. Brothers, he whines. He says, "I don't want to ride the car that long. I want to fly." He can't fly. He he's legally blind, and he would just get lost. That he's got to go with me. But he, I'll stop often for him. So we, we may take. <laughs> who knows? We may have to stop and get a room just to you know because of him, not because of me. But just we can do. We can do. I'm excited. You know, I there's things I want to do. I've been trying to get in some thrifting. I like to go to some bigger places like antique malls and flea markets and um, Goodwills, things like that. And the bigger city you get a much I'm assuming you have better things or more things, I mean not better. I have a in-home grooming business here. So, unfortunately, I've had to tell my customers that I'm moving. They're, of course, they wish me well, but they're disappointed because they really like me. And I'm disappointed because I, I've had a, I, I have a pretty nice business here. So, I'm, in, I'm up, I'm moving from my business in my home, in my family here. I have my daughters here, my grandchildren here. All because my ex will move out of the house. He won't let me live there till it's sold. And anyway, I'm not going down that road. <laughs> oh, I'm moving because I want to go on with my life and be happy. I'm not happy right now in this situation. The phone is bumping around. I can't see very well. I don't know how well you can see me because the sun is just shining in the car. Last time I did this, I uploaded it and you couldn't hear me, so I'm hoping you can hear me this time. I wanted to update you all what's going on. I haven't been online or on YouTube for several months. I've had my right knee replaced. I've had my shoulder, right and left shoulder replaced, total replacements. And um, I just been haven't been up to really filming full time or not even full time, even part time. I haven't been up to it. And two with the um, this divorce, I mean, you know, it's rough going through one. We've been together 21 years, so yeah, that's a long time. And I'm just I am not happy in this in that marriage. It's not this anymore. Just, just, no. I mean, life's too short. I expect a little more from a man who is married to me than, than what he's given me. I won't get into details. You don't want to know all the details. You know? Anyway, um, yeah, so I, I, you know, I was on the fence.
feelings about making this move on and off, on and off, but just gut feeling um, that I, I really want to do this and I really need to do this. You know, this is actually a need. I need to bond with that, with my son's family. I would love them to bond with me. Obviously, they have their lives. They're busy. They're all working. But, you know, there's going to be times where I can just pop on over some evening in their home and I chit-chat for a little while, you know? Maybe have dinner. Go out to dinner once in a while. See my grandkids and go play with them. I believe my granddaughter is a stay-at-home mom. I can't imagine her working with three children. I don't really know. <laughs> I talk to her, but I'll find out. I'm Anyway, yeah, I'm excited. I'm excited about that move, this move. Yeah. It's very, um, you know, it's expensive to move in time comes. I mean, and, uh, you know, it's, it's moving away from your home that you love. It's very emotional, draining. over this depression. Now, I'm kind of going on my depression now, but very anxious, that's for sure. But I'm a strong woman. I have been, my whole entire adult life, I have moved a lot. So I'm not new to this. I just would like to see different parts of the country state or whatever I I thought this house was gonna be my forever home but I was wrong I don't know when my forever home would be a part would be um, six feet under that would be my forever home now I won't be six feet under because I'm gonna be cremated but anyway, that's more than, don't go under that either <laughs> I know what my permanent be home home my permanent home would be heaven that's my permanent home. So this life here on Earth is temporary. Okay, I'm here in town and Walmart's just up the street. And I will probably pop on here and talk a little more. I'm really rusty on just chit-chatting. Probably things you're not really interested in me talking about, but for those who have watched me and wondered where I'm at, this is why I'm doing this vlog. All right, I'll be right back. See you soon. I thought I was recording. This is my goodbyes. I just wanted to tell you that I just got out of Walmart. I didn't film when I was in there. I never think about it. It's boring. I just went to the packing supplies, got some papers, some tape some shrink wrap things like that some big garbage bags things for packing um, got me a new sweatshirt pink I haven't seen a it's kind of a rosy color pink it's pretty because I need a new one but I don't need any more clothes I just want a new sweatshirt that's about it so now I'm on my way home I'm going to stop and get a quick snack go home oh I gotta find a U-Haul I still need some ex some large and extra large boxes so just want to update you on what's going on with me um, just hanging in there doing well every day gets better it's nice and beautiful today sunny 52 degrees here which is good for Michigan and I will update you as soon as I can. I plan on filming more once I get settled. I would love to do some Vlogmas in December. It won't probably be until like maybe the second or third week of December because I have to, I'm moving the first week of September. And yeah, so I'll get back on here, start doing some fun things. Um, if you're still here, thank you for staying and listening to me <laughs> update. Go ahead and give this video a like that helps me out a lot and comment um, you know what do you think um, I've missed you guys I love you and 
I wish you very, very happy Thanksgiving, and I will see you as soon as I can. Bye.